How's it going folks, Antoine here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to control your soundbar or AV receiver with your Amazon Fire Stick remote. Now this feature is extremely handy if you've lost your soundbar remote or you're just tired of using two separate remotes. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is grab your television remote and just make sure that the CEC option is enabled. Now in my case, I have a Vizio Smart TV, so my menu will look different than yours. But for the most part, you want to go into the menu and just look through all the tabs until you see CEC. There we go, right there. I'm going to go up to that. Once you select on it, just make sure it's enabled. See, mine's already enabled. So I'm going to go ahead and go back. Now on the Amazon Fire Stick, your CEC feature should already be enabled, but if it's not, uh, just go into the settings and make sure. Now in this um, example, I am using a TiVo, I mean, pff, TiVo. I am using the Amazon Fire Stick 4K. Um, and also one thing to remember is this will only work with Amazon remotes that have the volume controls on it. I don't know if you guys can see that. See if we can get that in there, but the TV, the TiVo, the Amazon Fire Stick 4K remote has the volume and power buttons for your television. You have to make sure you're, you have that Amazon remote. All right, back to our scheduling uh, program. All right, so you want to go over to your settings menu on your Fire Stick. Then you want to go down to equipment control, right? So right here, you're going to go to manage equipment and then you're going to go down to um, whatever device you plan on um, adding. You can add a sound bar um, and you have different options. At AV receiver, you simply go to um, add equipment and go to media player or uh, whichever device is appropriate for you. Well, in my case, we're using a Vizio soundbar. So, right here, we're going to select on change soundbar. Go up there. Now, the cool thing about Amazon, as opposed to the TiVo Stream 4K, is that Amazon pretty much is a smarter device, right? It's going to search for your soundbar and it's going to find it, especially if you're using the ARC feature, the HDMI ARC. Um, but in my case, I'm just using simple red and white RCA cable, so I know it's not going to find mine. So what I have to do is go through the list. I have a Vizio um, soundbar as well as a Vizio smart TV, so I got to be kind of cautious here so I don't turn my TV off when I'm testing out the um, soundbar. So we have Vizio here. And we just just follow along with the steps. It says we will be playing music during the next step. Uh, please make sure the volume on your soundbar is turned up. So we, we're hearing that sound right there. So it wants you to press power in the Fire Stick remote to turn up the soundbar. Soundbar just went off. Um, did your soundbar turn off? Let me turn it back on before we get to the next step. Yes. Now with your TV. Pointed at the remote, I mean, with your remote pointed at the TV, press the volume up. Now, let me scroll down here. Let's take a little trip down with me. Let's take, go ahead and take a little trip down with me. So, I got my sound bar. I moved it to the top of my entertainment system. So, you see the light indicators, or well, the lights indicate the volume controls and also the uh, power. So, it's working. I'm good to go. So, let's take a trip back up the street. All right, get us leveled up here, leveled off. All right, so let's use the fuzziness, but so we're gonna select on yes. So your Fire Stick remote has been updated. So now we got our Fire Stick remote programmed to our soundbar. Next, we wanna, what we wanna do is set the soundbar as our primary sound options. So what you're gonna do is, let me go back here from the manage equipment, let me go back out. So you guys, you're gonna go in equipment, go to manage equipment, go down to advanced settings, and you're gonna select on volume control device. Go up here, 
and we want our whenever we press the volume key on our remote we want it to control our sound bar or if you have an AV receiver it's going to be up there whatever audio device you have for it's going to be up there all right so we got it to our sound bar so that's already set so now we can exit back out now 